Yom Kippur, the Day of Atonement, fell ten days after the New Year. When we returned from work that evening, many men secreted themselves in corners and between bunks and prayed. The future loomed before us like a dark abyss that threatened to consume us. I was seized with a single thought. How can one still pray in such a situation? To whom could one pray? For what could one give thanks? Are we really a chosen people? And if chosen, for what? For suffering? I reflected on fragments of Jewish history, reports of the Spanish Inquisition, and pogroms perpetrated by God-fearing Christians streaming from church after Holy Mass. And now, here is another chapter in the history of this chosen people, suffering, humiliation, and extermination. I rebelled with all my thoughts and feelings. I refused to accept that my faith obliged me to endure suffering, conspiracies, and torments as a gift from God. Slowly, my heart turned to stone. Out! What was that? Damn Jews, out! 21, 22, 23, 24, Achtung! Listen, you damn Jews! It is not only your businesses and way of life that has been terminated. It is also your customs and service to God. Then we found out the reason for this odd nighttime appell. The camp command had heard that many of us had not eaten in order to fulfill the ritual of the Day of Atonement. Despite their poor general condition, these Jews resolved to hunger. How remarkable. The Nazis wanted to rob those who remained true to their faith of their inner strength. And so they sent Anton. As a child, he grew up in close proximity to Jewish people and learned their customs and traditions. He knew the Day of Atonement was the holiest day for Jews, even observed by free thinkers and assimilated Jews, just as in Christian surroundings, atheists celebrated Christmas. If I catch one of you who has not eaten his bread, he will get 50 strokes on his naked ass. I couldn't give two hoots about your God. We stood there, petrified, hearing his blasphemy in silence. Why did this blasphemy go unchallenged? Why did the heavens not open and give a visible sign of help? Was I right to abandon faith? God? My father's plea to be a good Jew? I didn't know. Shema Yisrael, Adonai Eloheinu, Adonai Echad. <laughs> 